Hey everyone, it's your girl Tanadra Shine, and I'm back with another video. I was just here sitting on the couch and I wanted to talk to y'all about the day that I had yesterday. So yesterday, I was completely, completely like depressed. And I am not the type of person that allows myself to get in my feelings and in my thoughts and be depressed. But yesterday was really bad. And I was letting the things of the world pile up on me and overtake the things that my spirit knows and that I know are more important than things of the world. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna just be real, I was tripping over my bills because I work for the school system here in Huntsville. I live in Huntsville, Alabama, I work for the school system. It's summer break right now. So I ain't making no money for real, besides like off my business. Shop with me at tonight.org if you would like. But anyways, um, yeah, and I had bills due and I was just like, Lord, how am I finna pay these bills? And so I ended up completely in a funk yesterday, completely. I didn't even wanna walk to the mailbox and it's two feet outside the door. That's how bad it was. Um, I had to drag myself out of the house to even go to the gym. At the end of the day, it all ended up getting better. Earlier today, I was thinking to myself, like, what if yesterday would have been my last day on the earth? You know what I'm saying? I would have spent my last day on God's green earth worrying about tomorrow. And tomorrow would have never even come, you know? And it just put a lot of things into perspective for me as far as, like, you can't be worried about things. And it's even in the Bible, it say, I can't remember like what verse and what chapter and all that, but it says, don't worry about everyday life because if God provides for the birds in the sky and we're more important than that, then surely we'll be taken care of. And the mistake that I made yesterday was not reminding myself of God's promises. I can't speak for anybody else, but as for me in my house, we praise the Lord. And like yesterday, I just, I wasn't as tuned in as I should have been and I allowed the world to really get in my head and I wasn't guarding my thoughts and it just got bad you know what I'm saying and hopefully with me sharing this with you all y'all can be aware of the fact that you are in control of your thoughts God gave you emotions for you to have not for them to have you and when you feel yourself getting in a funk you have to take control of that situation. If not, it'll drag on all day. And before you know it, you spent your whole day, day being depressed and being worried about something that like probably doesn't even matter. But anyways, long story short, yesterday this time I was stressed out. Today this time, all of my bills are paid for the whole rest of the month, praise the Lord. So it just goes to show that we spend our time sometimes we spend our time being upset or stressing or being depressed over things that probably won't even matter in a week. So we just have to be conscious of what's really going on. We have to be conscious of what we really, I guess I should say who we really serve. And if we truly wholeheartedly serve God, Jesus Christ, then we should know that all of our problems are taken care of. Even before they, even before we even know we got an issue, that issue already taken care of. You know what I'm saying? So I just wanted to hop on here and share that with y'all because yesterday was really, really, like really hard for me. And I was just like, Lord, like I know that I'm better than this because I've been broke before. <laughs> it's nothing to be broke. I still be having fun. I don't be looking broke. That's another thing. We as believers are billboards you know what i'm saying a lot of times we are all the guy that someone's gonna see so if you walk around looking like you're going through all the time somebody that doesn't know god is gonna be like if i have god and i'm gonna be hurt all the time i don't need god i'm gonna be straight without god so it's like we have to be conscious of the type of billboard that we're showing to people because we might be the only guy that they see but anyways I've been broke before and like I don't let it get to me but yesterday it got to me and I just had to like really realize that I can't be doing that <laughs> I cannot be doing that because I spent my whole freaking day y'all the whole day 
I planned on recording a video yesterday. I planned on editing a video yesterday. Nothing got done. Because I got in my feelings. And my feelings got the best of me. But I feel like it happened for a reason. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not going to let it happen again. That's for sure. And hopefully somebody can learn from my not so great day. But y'all, I love y'all. I appreciate the fact that y'all come visit my channel and hang out with me. Like I know I say at the end of every video, but I really do appreciate the fact that y'all come kick it with me. Cause it's so real that you couldn't have been anywhere in the world. I mean anywhere, well not anywhere in the world, but anywhere on the world wide web. You couldn't be anywhere, but you here with me. And like, it's so cool. Like it's really good for my ego. I'm not even playing, but Y'all feel free to subscribe to the channel. Feel free to share. I really do enjoy like, you know, hopping on my camera, putting stuff together for y'all, editing. Even though editing is very like, you know, annoying sometimes. It's worth it, it's worth it. I get a good laugh out of editing my videos, I ain't gonna lie. But anyways, you guys, it's been real. It could've been anywhere in the world, but you're here with me and that's good for my ego. I appreciate it. Come back by. Be sure to turn on your post notifications so you can know when I post. And you can always be here in Tanaja's world with me. But I'll catch you guys later. I love y'all.